and welcome back to my channel. I hope you are having a wonderful, lovely day. In today's video, I am back with another advent calendar unboxing and I am so, so, so excited. I loved this advent calendar last year, so I cannot wait to get into it and show you what we've got this year. I will link up my advent calendar playlist in the cards. So far, I've unboxed the big body shop advent calendar. I think it's called The Ultimate and I do have a few more on the way, so make sure to check that out. Before we jump in, to what is inside this calendar and all of the details that you need to know. If you are new here, why not stick around and press subscribe because I have the best things coming. Like, it's just the most exciting time for me. It's Christmas, so I'm doing advent calendars. I'm moving house, so I'm doing moving vlogs and decorating and home hauls. I'm testing out a Dyson Air Wrap for the first time. Today I am testing out just a slightly different way of doing it. Um, it looks really nice and bouncy now, but we'll have to see how it lasts. But there's just so much fun, as well as all my usual plus size fashion hauls. So now is the perfect time to join my channel. And I am also edging up to 20,000 subscribers, which is a huge goal for me. Numbers don't matter, but they, they, they're exciting. Everyone loves hitting a milestone. So if you want to help me out to reach my goal of 20,000, I would be eternally grateful. I have a huge, my biggest giveaway planned that I've ever done, so I'm very excited. So let's get on in to the Glossy Box Surprise Me Advent Calendar, and it is heavy. The packaging is very similar to last year. It's got the doors that open and then drawers inside with boxes. But let me just give you some information about the calendar. So just to be transparent, this was gifted to me by Glossy Box, so thank you so much, Glossy Box, because I am a ambassador for glossy box i'm in the glossy circle so i unbox their regular monthly boxes so they kindly sent this to me but that doesn't mean that i'm not going to tell you the truth whether i'm gifted something whether i'm being sponsored the one condition i always have is that i tell you the truth so whether or not i paid for this i will tell you if i think it's worth it so this advent calendar costs 105 pounds if you're not a subscriber or you can save 20 pounds and get it for 85 pounds if you are a subscriber now if you want to save 20 pounds i've got a little trick for you if you add a glossy box into your basket and you use my code trina that gives you your first glossy box for 10 pounds but then you also qualify for the 20 pounds discount on this calendar so for 95 pounds you get this and a box instead of paying 105 pounds just for this so if you are interested it's definitely worth saving yourself a bit of money and also getting some extra goodies so i will link everything down below it will be an affiliate link so if you use my link thank you so much i make a small amount of commission at no extra cost to you but most importantly it shows the brand that you've come from my video so i'm very grateful for anyone that uses my links if you don't want to no problem but if you do thank you okay i want to get inside because i am very excited i'm very very excited i just love like my new beauty room in my new house is going to be pink gold and white so this is just and this shade of pink as well this is everything in terms of inspiration for my new room so like i said it just opens up like this it says unforgettable moments of joy on this side and glossy box on that side i'm just going to tuck the doors to the side so that we can get in the drawers so Okay, let's find out where door number one is. So door number one is quite conveniently in the top. So this is what I was saying. We've got drawers with boxes inside and then the boxes just pop out of the drawer. So door number one is a huge box. But I have to say there is something rattling around. So let's see what we've got in here. This is a great first door. I'm not gonna lie, this is a great first door. We've got an Elemis product. Now, when I first pulled this out, I thought it was gonna be a pro collagen marine cream, which would have been great. I've just had quite a few samples of that recently, but it isn't. It is the pro collagen energizing marine cleanser so this is a product that i haven't tried elemis is a pricey pricey brand full size this product would be 42 pounds for this 30 mil mini it is 16 pounds so still a very good product behind door number one i'm excited to try this i have loved everything i've ever tried from elemis so i think that we are off to a great start okay where is door number two is it in the second drawer nope i like i said in my um body shop advent calendar i'm really glad that the doors are all just because I think they should be in an advent calendar you should have to go hunting for the door but it does make my job of unboxing quite a bit more difficult and it does take a little bit more time is it in the top one no see I've missed it let me find it 
I am dyslexic so I think the fact that some of them are numbers and some of them are words really just messed with my brain a little bit because I opened this drawer about three times and I couldn't see that box number two was here in the bottom so <laughs> hey ho we will get there so number two feels a little bit heavier let's see what we've got in here we've got a palette this is exciting i love skincare but makeup is always going to be the thing that gets me the most excited so we have got a wonder beauty product this is the trip for two blush and bronzer duo and this is worth 25 pounds 50. i did forget to tell you how much this calendar is worth overall 465 pounds so a great value overall so yeah this is a bronzer and brush duo and I've got lipstick on my hand that's embarrassing oh the blush looks right up my street the bronzer looks like it's quite a cool tone bronzer now obviously with complexion products this isn't going to work for everyone's skin tone I feel like blushes you can get away with a little bit more because a lot of skin tones can use a lot of different types of blusher but bronzer is a little bit more individual um to your specific skin type tone so not everyone will be able to use this but I guess if you can't use it as a bronzer you could use it as an eyeshadow just pop it in your crease if you're looking for a really quick simple look let's give these a swatch pretty creamy yeah that's quite a light shade for a bronzer so if you've got anything darker than medium skin I think you might struggle a bit um it will work for me but that's not the point so that is the bronzer there and the blush is beautiful I love that shade of blush that's gorgeous um so I'm very excited about this and I will get a lot of use but I appreciate that it's not going to be for everyone. Door number three. I forgot to say it does come with a little booklet that has got all the details and all the prices and information inside so that is what I'm referring to when I tell you the price. So door number three looks like this. Super light. Super super light. Okay we got one of did we get one of these last year or did we get one in the Look Fantastic Advent Calendar? I'm not entirely sure. But we have got a satin sleeping mask from the brand Glove. It says, sleep like a queen and wake up as a goddess. I love that. If I could wake up like all put together and composed, that would be a dream come true because I am a mess in the morning. This is £6.90. I don't really use sleeping masks, to be honest. Um, but if you're someone that travels a lot, not that, who's traveling? Um, or that needs to sleep in absolute pitch black, this could be really good for you. I have to say it's so super, super soft. Like if you're gonna have an, a sleeping mask, this is the one to have. This is gorgeous, super soft. So not the best door for me, but if this is the kind of thing you like, great door. Door number four is the biggest box I have ever seen in an advent calendar. Just you wait. I honestly have never seen a box this big in an advent calendar. It's like the size of an Apple Watch box. Can you imagine if this was an Apple Watch? I mean, it's, it's not. Let's not. Let's not. You know. <laughs> it isn't the heaviest, but it is huge. So I am, I am very intrigued. Let us see. Take out the little tissue papers. That's gonna be good. I need to save these whilst I'm moving, actually. These will be really helpful for me whilst packing. Hmm. Okay, we have got, it's from Sarah Chapman London. It's the Skin Assist and it's the Face Lift, Facial Lift. Okay, so this looks like one of those kind of like facial massages. I don't want to use it because I've done my makeup, um, but we'll get it out and have a look. How much is this? 30 pounds, 30 pounds, <laughs> oh my gosh. Sometimes I'm like, are you sure it's worth that much? But the thing is, I don't know anything about this product. If you are someone that uses this kind of tool, let us know in the comments. Is it something that works or is it just something that feels nice? So it's got these rollers on and then these flexible arms here. And there's different ways you can do it. You can do it on your chin, on your neck, on very, loads of different places. I'm gonna have to give this a try, but yeah, please let me know in the comments if you know anything about this kind of tool and like the legitimacy of what it can offer. And also let me know in the comments, guys, what your favorite door is. I'm always interested to hear what your favorite product is. So interested to give it a try. 
not completely sold but if it makes me feel like I'm being pampered I'm always up for it. If the camera angle moved at all then I'm sorry my battery was dying as usual so I had to change it. Number five was in the bottom drawer. It is a wee baby one let's see. Okay I'm interested to hear your opinion on this product because I know that a lot of people are a little bit fed up of this brand I I enjoy some of their products, not all of them. We have got a product from Avant. This is the eight hour retexturizing and anti-oxidizing hyaluronic facial serum. They always have the longest names. They are in Advent calendars and subscription boxes very often. And some people say it's to bump up the price because this is an 89 pound product. And some people don't think it justifies the price. I think some people enjoy the product, some people just think they're a little bit overpriced and it just adds to the big value of the box overall. I haven't tried this product. I've tried a couple of moisturizers that I like. I've tried an eye cream that I really didn't. I've tried a mask that I was so-so about. So I'm intrigued to give this a go, but I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments because I know that people feel quite differently. But if you love Avant, then great to get a full size product in here. Door number six is in the third drawer found that first time. So this is a heavier one. Saving all the packaging. Oh, people are going to be very happy about this. We've got a molten brown product. This is the Heavenly Ginger Bath and Shower Gel. It is a deluxe mini and you get 100 mils and it's worth 10 pounds. I know that molten brown is a super, super popular brand. It's not my favorite favorite brand of shower gels but I do enjoy them. Ginger would be really good in the morning to like wake you up and freshen you up. Let's have a sniff. It's not that potent. Like ginger I think could be like a love it or hate it scent maybe and it's there but it's quite subtle. I am looking forward to using this. I do tend to go for a more fruity scent but I do enjoy using the molten brown shower gels. They're not my favourite but I always enjoy them. Door number seven is in the bottom drawer. It's another smaller box but it's not too light. We have got a product from Grow Gorgeous. This is the Intense Thickening Hair and Scalp Mask. We've got 30 mils so this is a deluxe mini worth nine pounds. I think I've had or tried one product from Grow Gorgeous before. I'm not 100% sure. I've heard a little bit about them, but not the most. A thickening mask that's for the scalp. I get really greasy hair really quickly, so I try and avoid any kind of masks on my scalp if possible. But I'm always willing to give new products a try, especially if it's just going to like give me a bit of thickness and volume on the top. So I do find that my hair gets a little bit more heavy on the top. So willing to give it a go would have preferred if it wasn't a scalp mask because I love a good hair mask. But I'm always up for trying something new and I feel like I just said that about 10 seconds ago. So <laughs> if you're new here, I'm quite repetitive. Door number eight is in the second drawer. Super, super, super light. The lightest one I think we've had. That is why it is a eyebrow pencil. This is from W7 and it's the Super Brows Super Definition Eyebrow Pencil. We've got a pencil on one side and a spoolie on the other. It's a different, oh, it's not a spoolie. It's more of a look like, I don't know if you'll see, it's quite small. It's more of a brush than a spoolie. This is in the shade, what shade is it? brown. <laughs> eyebrow products are going to be really difficult. Again, everyone has different eyebrow shades, so it's going to be difficult to get a one size fits all. But I think usually going somewhere in the middle between like a really dark shade and a really light shade is the best chance of getting a shade that's going to work for everyone because you could press lighter or you could press darker. I'm not going to open this because I don't really use brow products. And if I did, I don't think it would be this kind of pencil. At the moment, at most, I use a brow gel. So I'm going to pop this away for someone else who can get more use out of it. This is worth £2.95. Door number nine is in the top. I'm here like <laughs> struggling to see in. Okay, we have another light one. What do we have? Of course. Of course we do. <laughs> this is from Ico and it's the Black Magic Liquid Eyeliner. Now I'm not mad because I love this eyeliner. It has got a brush tip applicator and it is really black and it's my favourite kind of eyeliner. I love anything with a brush tip like the KVD Beauty Tattoo Liner um, or who else does it? It's anyone that has like a brush tip. Now 
yes this is in pink so it's super super cute but I have had about six of these this year it works out for me because they're my favorite but if you don't like this product and you're subscribed to any kind of subscription box service you've got about three of them in your drawer <laughs> this is worth 16 pounds and I love that it's pink like that hits me in the heart I love anything pink I'm a sucker for packaging and I love this product so I'm happy but if, like I said, if you've got a couple of them already, you probably don't need another one. Number 10 is in the bottom. Again, quite light. A lot of light boxes. So we have got, we have got a James Reed product. This is the Gradual Tan. It's a sleep mask for the face with retinol. I said that very strangely, retinol, <laughs> retinol. Um, this is a 25 mil worth 15 pounds pricey pricey we're gonna have to have a read about this so this is a de-aging multi-action gradual tan which uses japanese inspired sleep pack technology and retinol to work wonders in the golden hours of sleep targeting any problem areas of your skin it also helps to create a healthy glow this is intriguing i have to admit i don't use any tanning products i've got a drawer full of them that i've got in various boxes and things because i always say i want to do a testing video but i'm terrified of tan and it never happens so maybe one day we will have like we'll dig into that archive of <laughs> tanning products that i've got and actually try some out this is interesting i've never heard of a sleeping tanning mask have you tried this let me know in the comments because i am intrigued for someone that doesn't use tanning products i am actually intrigued number 11 is in the second one and it's a bit heavier <laughs> heaviness doesn't equate to it being a good product it's just it's just interesting <laughs> okay this is a product that everybody knows and loves this is the pixie glow tonic we've got the mini size it's 100 mils and this is worth 10 pounds now this will last you a long time i have got too many toners open that it's sort of getting to the point now where i'm probably going to have to you know let some of them go because they've been open for a while because you need a few drops of this this could last you six months probably if you use it once a day maybe a bit less if you use it twice it is a great toner it's got five percent glycolic acid it's going to really help you to um get rid of that top layer of dull skin and uncover the fresh healthy glowing skin underneath you use it as a first step in your skincare routine after you've done any cleansing if you're going to use this don't use any other exfoliating products because this is an exfoliating toner so I've had quite a few of these, but it is a cult classic product that I know a lot of people love. So if you don't already have it and you've never tried it, this is the perfect chance. Number 12 is in the bottom. Let's see what we've got. Okay, we have got a Vitamasks Lip Mask Plump and Repair. So this is a one-time use product. This is worth £4.99. £4.99. This is going to help if you've got dehydrated and chapped lips, which, you know, in winter is a saviour. I don't know how much I buy into these kind of lip masks. Get me like a um, sleeping lip mask, you know, like one that you apply on. I'll Honestly, I love them. I have so many lip balms. It's a bit of a problem. But this kind of product, I'm never 100% sure how much I see an effect. But this is plumping. So that's interesting. I'm very much up for giving it a go and I love the packaging. I've had a few masks from Vitamasks before that I do enjoy. So I'm not mad. Number 13 and it's the last box in this drawer. Finally, one less for me to open every time I try and find a new box. So what do we have in here? We've got a brush. Who's this by? Oh, we've got a Laura Geller brush. This is a deluxe mini brush. It's not a full size. It's sort of a shorter handle. This is the Touch Up All Over Face Brush worth 13 pounds. It's soft. I like the feeling of it. It's just not, <laughs> I feel like I've been a bit negative, guys. <laughs> it's just not my favorite shape of brush. I'd maybe use it for blusher, um, but I like to have a bit of a more like, dispersed bigger brush for blush like it's a bit a bit dirty but this is my blusher brush I like that kind of shape so I can focus a bit more product and then bring it down but I will definitely make use you know what it could be quite nice for under eye powder actually so it says that it is ideal for 
applying foundation or setting powders or you can use it as a final step in your routine to blend out any unwanted blush or bronzer lines. It has a hugging shape and it's going to ensure a beautiful flawless finish. I'm excited. I've never had a, anything from Laura Geller. I think they're quite well known for their gelato swirl highlighters um but i've not tried anything from laura geller so very excited to give it a go very soft very very soft i will definitely get some use out of that okay number 14 i feel like i'm losing my voice a bit uh here you are in drawer number three. Oh, this one's a bit heavier let's see okay oh this is a brand that we were introduced to in the advent calendars last year i hadn't really heard of them before then but they've really hit the subscription boxes this year this is from e-cooking this is the peeling mask now we got this recently in a subscription box so let me go and get the one that i've already got so i don't have to open this one so this is it i haven't used it yet but i know that i opened it in my video to show so it is 15 mils worth 11 pounds 10 and it's like a creamy texture inside and this is going to be a product again similar to the pixie product but maybe a little bit more intense that's going to help to remove that first layer of dull dying skin to reveal fresh smoother softer skin it does make it says don't panic if your skin turns red that means it's working i remember that making me laugh so it could make your skin go a little bit red and a little bit irritated for a small amount of time because you are really exfoliating but hopefully it doesn't last and if it does stop using it it's not for you <laughs> um so i already have that but i'm not mad because if I use this up and I like it, I'll be glad to have another one. And it's quite a different product to get in an advent calendar. So I'm happy about that. Door number 15. Door number 15 is at the top. We have got another super light box. Okay, what do we have in here? So many packaging bits. What? I can't get it out. Okay, we have got the Magnetone London Wipeout Swipes. Now, we've seen Magnetone quite a bit in the advent, in the subscription boxes this year, and I've had this product before, but I, I did enjoy it. So they are super soft, really, really soft. Their cloths are so soft from Magnetone. Um, microfiber cleansing sort of pads. These are worth seven pounds. Now, the ones that I've had before, I tried using for removing makeup and I just didn't find them up to scratch for that. They're a bit too small and a bit too, like, soft. I need something a little bit more, like, I need something that's going to really get on in there. What I think these are probably great for is for applying your toners so that we can stop using reusable cotton pads that just end up in the bin. Something like this would be really good to pop a bit of toner on and then pop it on your skin. Or if you've got any stubborn eye makeup and you want to use something a bit softer around the gentle eye skin, you can put your eye makeup remover on here and use it in that way. Um, super, super soft. I love Magnetone cloths. I can never have enough cloths. So I'm happy. Not the most exciting, but very practical. Guys, let me know what you're thinking of this calendar so far. I'm very, very interested to hear your thoughts. Door 16. I will save mine until the end where are you you're in the bottom okay we have got a lip pencil from steve laurent this is a full size product worth 10 pounds 70 let's have a look at the shade can i get it out of the box <laughs> okay so this is in the shade uptown which is a really nice hopefully you can see a really nice brown shade with maybe like a hint of red but it really is a dark brown so this is super super long so if you're going to use a lot of a lip liner you're going to get a lot of use out of that and it is a really pretty shade and i'm always glad to see more makeup number 17 is in the third drawer we've got a bigger box here we have got we have got what is this? This is from the brand Booslimi. So sorry for butchering that. But it's a, oh, it's a scalp massager. I couldn't tell what it was. 
I've never had one of these. Let me get out of the plastic because it's loud. So this is what it looks like. This is 12 pounds and it's full size. It's got really soft rubber bristles and you can just put it in your hand like this. And let's read what the idea is because I've never had one of these. So it's a cleverly created scalp massager that is sure to give you that tingly head massage feeling we all love, boosting circulation and overall scalp health too. This tool is flexible, soft and easy to grip, allowing for gentle use, the perfect addition to your favorite shampoo and conditioner use. That is gonna feel so nice in the shower. We can use this in the shower to massage our head. Then we've got our facial massager for after. It does feel like a bit of a pampering session with it. That feels so nice. I'm gonna try and not mess your hair up, Trina. It's already, already dropping out. Very different door, but I'm not gonna lie. I can't wait to give this a go. Very happy with that. Number 18 is in the top. Ooh, okay. We have, oh, we have got a product from Zoeva. This is the Infinite Potential Mascara. Full volume, perfect. I love a volumizing mascara. This is worth 15 pounds in the shade black. I will definitely be trying this out. So let's see what the brush looks like. Oh, it's giving very Charlotte Tilbury vibes with the like light, almost cream pink with the rose gold. This is reminding me a lot of the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk mascara. So let's see, infinite potential. Okay, it has a wand, which is quite similar to um, Too Faced Better Than Sex. So I am gonna give that a go tomorrow. I love this store. I love testing out new mascaras because I'm actually really fussy when it comes to a mascara. So I always get excited at the prospect of finding a new one. It's not very often that I like new mascara, but I'm always looking forward to trying a new one. Number 19 is here in the third drawer. So what do we have? We have such a tiny product for such a big box. I know they probably just need to make the boxes to fit so that they can make it look beautiful. So I won't be too mad, but it is quite funny. This is a steep sleep pillow spray from This Works. We got quite a few of these in last year's advent calendars. This deluxe mini of five mils is worth six pounds. And the idea is that you spray this on your pillow before you go to sleep and it's gonna help to relax you and help you to have a deeper sleep. We're gonna have to give it a sniff. I just went right on my face okay I think that would be quite relaxing it's got quite a bit of lavender in so I'm not the biggest fan of lavender so it's just something to be aware of but I know that lavender is really calming and soothing so it makes perfect sense so it's lavender chamomile and the vet vetivert something like that. So it's a wee baby sample, but I think with how potent it is, one or two spritz is all you're gonna need. Okay, door number 20, we are getting to the end. It is on the top. Let's see what we've got in here. We have got a product from Laritzi Cosmetics, and this is the Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick in the shade Peach Nude. No, Nude Peach. <laughs> Let's have a look at this. This is worth 14 pounds. Ooh, okay. I like the shade. It's not peachy though. I would say this is more of a like nudie brown shade rather than a peachy shade. I haven't tried their liquid lipsticks before, so let's give it a swatch. I love this shade. It feels very, yes it is. It's very similar to like one of my favorite liquid lipsticks of all time, Huda Beauty, the Venus shade. I talk about that all the time. This feels quite similar, so very much up my street. The wand is a bit a bit bent though. I don't know if it's like meant to be or not. <laughs> Let me know in the comments if you've got one of these, if yours is bent. <laughs> um, so this is a matte liquid lipstick, which is my favorite formula. I love a lipstick that's gonna dry and just stay there all day. So I'm very happy, more makeup, which is just always what I want. Door 21, here in the bottom. Oh, it's a big one. What have we got? Oh yay, oh yay. This is from Bubble Tea. It is the Bath Crumble in Pink Grapefruit. I am so excited about having a new bath in my new bathroom. I wanna turn it into a like really zen spa-like situation and I'm collecting bath bombs and bath products at the moment. So very happy with this. This is £4.99, it's full size. We're gonna have to give it a sniff. Gonna have to give it a sniff. 
I love anything fruity scented, especially citrus scented. I say that in a lot more than I ever expected I would say. It comes up very often in videos. So you get quite a few pieces of the crumble. Oh, even through this plastic, which I'm gonna to have to open, you can smell them. Nice, it isn't super intense. I was hoping it would be a little bit more intense, but the proof is in the pudding when we actually put it in the water. So this is gonna simulate and soothe and have a relaxing aroma. We got there in the end. Very, very happy about this. Can you tell I'm filming late at night? It is. 10 to 9. I haven't cooked dinner yet. Sorry, Adam. <laughs> Door number 22 is here. It's a wee baby one. Let's see what we've got. We have got a product from Verso. This is the nourishing cream with niacinamide. It's 15 mils, which is worth £23.20 for this little thing. I don't think I've tried anything from this brand before. This is an intense moisturiser with long-term hydration. It's formulated with a high concentration of niacinamide, oat lipids and oils from the Nordics. This cream is going to help to improve the barrier of outer layer of your skin. So 15 mils of a moisturiser, you'll get a good amount of tries from that. So yeah, it's a new brand for me to try. I always enjoy trying new brands, so happy with that. If you can see mess behind me, I've just realised you can probably see mess. It's because I'm living amongst boxes. I'm literally starting to move my stuff into storage tomorrow. So my house is a mess. We just have to, we have to be friends here and we have to be kind and accepting of my mess. Door number three is the last one in the top drawer. We have got... Oh, we have got a mini lipstick from Illamasqua. I feel like I got one of these in an advent calendar last year. This is a mini two grams worth, 12 pounds, full size is 17. This is in the shade Bang. I think, I think I might have Bang. Let me just go and check because again, I don't want to open this up. If I already got it, I can pass it on to someone else. Yeah, Bang is the <laughs> shade that I have. <laughs> So let me pop that one away and I'll swatch this one for you. So they are teeny tiny little babies, but for a lipstick, I kind of enjoy minis because whoever uses up a full lipstick, it is quite similar to the liquid lipstick that we got a moment ago. Let me give it a swatch. So this is what it looks like swatched. It's really pigmented and creamy, but it also has a little bit of staying power as well, which is good for a lipstick. I just love how like pigmented this is wish we had a different shade because they're very similar but I love this shade so I would be super super happy but like I said I've already got it so that can go into my 20k giveaway 24 it's Christmas Eve the magic has arrived we are sat around the tree with our friends and family hopefully I hope that for everyone and we're getting excited about Christmas tomorrow I love Christmas I cannot wait oh we've got a huge one and it's heavy it's very heavy. Okay, let's see. Oh, we're being treated at the end. This is a product from Rodeal. It is the Soft Focus Glow Drops. This is 50 pounds. <laughs> I knew it was gonna be expensive, but I didn't know it was gonna be 50 pounds. This is a full size product, one fluid ounce. Let's get this out. I've had a couple of products from Rodeal before that I've really enjoyed. Oh, look at this. It's a beautiful pink in a frosted glass bottle. This is just screaming to be on my vanity in my new beauty room. So this is an aluminum an illuminating ultimate glow primer. We're gonna have to swatch this. I can't believe it's 50 pounds though. <laughs> That's a lot of money. So this is sort of skincare and makeup in one because it is a primer that you can put on before makeup, but it's gonna give you some skincare benefits with the antioxidants that are gonna help to rejuvenate your skin, which is gonna create the perfect dewy base. Sounded like I knew all that, but I definitely was, definitely was reading that from the cards. Okay, so it is pink, which is probably gonna help with that glow. Oh, it's, does it smell? It does, it's not bad. I just wasn't expecting that smell. It's, I'm not sure what that is. It's almost a bit citrusy, dare I say. <laughs> so this is what it looks like on the hand. Really, really thin in consistency, sinks beautifully into the skin, ignoring the stain from the lip, um, lipstick. 
I think that is gonna go beautifully. Look how glowy that is. Oh, I'm not the biggest primer girl. I'm learning though, I'm learning. Um, but that is something I can get on board with for sure. Okay, okay, glossy box. Favorite day so far? Might be my favorite day so far. Okay, Christmas day. We are sad because our advent calendars are finishing, but we're happy because we're hopefully about to feast on the most gorgeous Christmas dinner ever. 25 is in the bottom one and it is big. Last year, I think I have it to hand actually, last year we got, found it, I had to go digging because my stuff is everywhere because my room is like three quarters packed. But last year for Christmas, we got this palette from Iconic London. It was called the Day to Slay palette, it's huge. And it was a beautiful, neutral, almost like pinky golden palette with some beautiful shimmers in there. I haven't used it the most, but when I have used it, I have enjoyed it. So that's what we got for Christmas last year. Let's see what we've got for Christmas this year. It's heavy. Feels like a palette. It is a palette! Okay, wow, okay, they've outdone themselves this year with Christmas Day. We've got a full size Huda Beauty palette. This is the Mercury Retrograde. This is a stunning palette. I have it, let me get mine. I got mine for Christmas last year from Adam. Let me get mine so we don't have to open this one. Got it, so it is beautiful. It is a lot more bright than the palette we got last year. This, mine is a little bit of a mess, but it's it's okay. This is what it looks like inside. We've got some neutrals in there. You could go for a neutral golden look. We've got some blue, some purples. We could go for a bit more of a dark, smoky maroon look. This is 58 pounds, guys. Huda Beauty palettes. I have three three now in this size and I have like six or seven of her mini nine pen palettes. I love Huda Beauty. This is, this makes the calendar. This absolutely makes the calendar. This is an incredible palette. I love this shade Cosmic. Let me swatch a few for you. This one, Mercury, the beautiful blue. We'll go for Galaxy and then let's go for this matte that is Hot Mess beautiful beautiful shadows let me swatch them on my arm for you i'm not the best at swatching but if i hold it up like this just look at that look at the pigment absolutely that's beautiful really really gorgeous if you want to dip into color and play with some more vibrant shades this will be a really good way to go because you could just go quite colorful with the shimmer and quite neutral with the mattes or you could go all out this oh let's swatch one of these more golden shades oh that was wet almost this is called gold glitch let me pop it can you see if i pop it here that's stunning. Look how sparkly that is. I don't know if it's picking up because it's pitch black outside. This is an absolutely incredible palette and I'm blown away. This calendar, if you're a subscriber, is £85. And if you wanted to get this on its own, it's £58. So brilliant, brilliant last door. Oh, and this can go in my 20,000 subscriber giveaway pile. Oh my gosh, that is gonna be the most incredible prize. If you are not subscribed, please do, because as soon as I hit 20,000, I'm so excited for that giveaway. It's gonna be so much fun. Okay, so that is everything in the 2021 Glossy Box Advent Calendar. Now, I want to know what you think in the comments, because I have mixed, mixed thoughts. Take away the palette for a minute. I think last year's calendar was probably a little bit better. Um, and it could be because there was quite a few products in here that if you are a Glossy Box subscriber or if you have a couple of subscription boxes, you've probably already had. So in that sense, without the palette, last year's was better. Add in the palette. If you don't already have that palette, this is just incredible such such good value and if you don't have the palette i would highly recommend this or if you want to give the palette to someone else as a christmas present and you want to treat yourself to the rest at a super discounted price so if you were going to buy the palette for someone else so 58 pounds on the palette for 58 60 is 2 plus 15 is 17 for 17 pounds more you could get everything else so in that sense i think this is an incredible deal 
I think I'm only a little bit less excited about it for two reasons. One, because a lot of the stuff I said, like I've said, you have got in subscription boxes recently. And two, because I already have the palette. So that's the main event. And because I already have the main event, this is never going to be like the most 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 unbelievably exciting but it is still super exciting and I cannot wait to give the palette to one of you so if you haven't got the palette really think about who the palette could go to and what the other products are in here and if the other products get you excited because there are some incredible products in here especially that rhodial primer very excited then definitely give this a go it's great value and if you don't have the palette buy this use the link down below use my discount code don't use my discount code use any link buy it if you don't have the palette because i promise you if you've never tried put a beauty before you will love her eyeshadows so that wraps up another advent calendar unboxing my chair is really squeaky i have had the most fun thank you so much again to glossy box for gifting this to me i'm so grateful i hit it very hard then thank you so so much for watching if you've enjoyed this video if you could give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more please subscribe to stick around and i will see you next time bye